Strictly Come Dancing professional AJ Pritchard, 24, admitted he is yet to sign a contract for the show's next series, but would love to dance with the Queen if he could. Spilling all on this morning. Host Eamon Holmes and Ruth Langsford quizzed AJ on his ideal dance partner. He replied, up there number one is the queen. Imagining how they would perform together, he added, a beautiful waltz, step, side, close. Ruth then asked who else he would like to share the dance floor with, with the queen being a far-fetched choice. The professional dancer didn't mention a name, but said he would have to think about their height. He said, in TV soap land the correct height obviously I have a thing for height, so that removes a lot of people. Later in their chat, the hosts informed AJ Virgin Radio host Chris Evans said he is up for dancing on this show. AJ replied, I think Chris Evans will be great, if he does it, the dancer went on to say he is yet to sign up for this year's series like the rest of his team. He explained, like any contract, we wait until that phone call comes, obviously I'd love to be back so fingers crossed, when that phone call does come, that it's all good. When does it come? Later this month, I don't know when that is, meanwhile, AJ recently revealed, why he won't be dancing with last year's Strictly partner Lauren Stadman, 26, anytime soon. The dancer is set to go on his solo tour Get On The Floor later this year, but admitted Lauren will not be joining him as she's too busy with her work commitments. Speaking of the Paralympian, he told ITV News, Lauren told me she is traveling to Lanzaret to train for her World Championships which is the Olympics in Tokyo in 2020. She is killing herself getting back to fitness. She's a bit busy, but I'll do a little live stream like we are doing now, and she'll love the show. AJ and Lauren made it to the semi-final of the BBC show last year, just missing out on the final four. The Glitter Ball trophy was won by Stacey Dooley and Kevin Clifton. This morning airs weekdays from 10. 30 a.m. on ITV.